Hey everyone, welcome back to Castlevania. I'm just dealing with this skeleton. Which I'm hoping I can destroy him. There we go. That was close. Skeleton dropped a key. Perfect. We're going to take that. Whoa, that was, uh... That was an experience. Um... Okay, I think it's just telling us that we got the key. Uh, I looted this guy's body. He had a blue crystal. And how are you guys doing? Uh, I'm doing pretty good. It took me a... Oh, that'd be so bad if I just died. Jumped off the edge there. Um, I'm doing pretty good. It's... Um... I was going to say it's Friday evening, but that doesn't really have a lot of relevance to what I'm doing. Surely we can just jump, right? Yeah, okay, here we go. Uh, it took me a while to get back to the skeletons, actually, because the where it started me out was a bunch of sword masters, and they killed me a lot, but on the bright side, I got pretty good at fighting sword masters, though I might lose that all again. And you can tell I need to reload this guy. Like, I think I died three more times afterwards. Um, which is pretty cool in my mind. I, and it's fun playing on hard because like it forces you to get good because it punishes your mistakes. Uh, and I was like freaked out because I'm like, oh no, I'm not recording. But no, I was recording. I was talking. I was so focused on the game and this difficulty that I zoned out for a minute. And I forgot what I was talking about. Oh. Oh. Alright, well I know what's happening next. Um... Well, right now we're going to do some exploring. Here we go. Those, uh, those puppets look very ominous. And they've been giving us a lot of shadow gems. I hate to use my shadow magic more. I'm just... My problem is I get so caught up using light magic that I just don't think to use the shadow magic, even though I probably should. Can you scroll? There's some writing on the sides of this strange machine. The color shall no longer be the red if you drop the balls. All using your head... This ring was a gift from my mother, the queen. The color shall no longer, shall be no longer the red. To get to your throne, all hinges must be green. All right, I'm not really sure what's talking about, though. I guess to be fair, I don't have context. Oh, hello. Oh. Select the ball. Okay, so we dropped the ball. So how does this work? Oh, all must be green. Okay, I see what's going on here. So. So this goes... One, two... Okay, so I guess... So that's one, two, three, one, two, th three, dang, so close, um, that would click that, but how do we get the other one? Do we drop it again? Oh yes, okay, so we drop it again. We have that. It's gonna. Oh, that's gonna turn that one off, though. Oh, I get it. Oh, but turn, oh, I. Okay, and then I think we do this. Oh, actually, I don't know. I'm gonna screw this up. Yeah, dang, we screwed this up then. I'm convinced we can do this, though. Alright, so basically if we, um... Use a slot, it changes. And this actually might do it. There we go. Puzzle solved. See, and I like those puzzles because, like, it even... I was gonna say, it even causes me to think, which really sounds like I have an ego problem. But no, it's a challenging puzzle, which... Like, it's intuitive, 
Um, but like, you still have to think about it. All right, cool. So we're gonna continue our quest. Uh, ooh, electric laboratory. I think I know what this is. This is gonna be a little bit painful. I think this part of the castle was once where acclaimed scientist Friedrich von Frankenstein conducted his experiments into artificial life. He was quite mad and often would conduct horrific and depraved acts trying to discover the secrets of life itself. His own demise was equally gruesome. The vampire queen took him, but kept him alive thus over many centuries. She fed on him daily, keeping him at the brink of death, yet living and aware. Why she did this is only known to a few. She once loved life and loved living things, and before she became a Lord of Shadow, she vowed she would punish Frankenstein for his vile acts. As a Dark Lord, she was able to keep her word. Okay. Oh, yeah, man. One thing I want to talk about, and this is way back. This is like a couple episodes ago. He made a comment about, like, Gabriel not needing more than physical strength to defeat the Vampire Lord because um, she might try to seduce him. That's a very common trait of vampires. Typically, they have high charisma, which allows them to, um, well, seduce their opponents and they just feed off of them. Anyways, you have a scroll. Let's read this. I spent two days in this labyrinth trying to figure out a way out of here. With some observation, it is easy to see the strange devices create deadly barriers between red and blue ones. Now I need to find a way to make them switch colors. Okay. Also, there's a lot more puzzles than I realized. Okay, so punch this. That can't be right. That's very hard to aim. That, yeah, okay, hold on. Punch this button? This is the only way I know how to punch those, by jumping in the air. Dang, I was, I mean, we're making a mess, that's for sure. Okay, so a little bit from the wall, let's try this. How on earth do we punch this? Oh dear, this is this is not a good look. I can't I can't figure out how to punch puzzles or punch punch the floor, guys. Dear, this is embarrassing. Oops, I deserve that. Oh, we have to do it like that. I don't know. I feel like that's um. No, that can't be right. Alright, so what this actually do? So this was like the red one, so we can help the red conductors? Oh, so that's red and that's blue. So we hit this, we turn off the red conductors, we turn on the blue ones? Oh dear, alright. Um... I might need to Google search this in between videos because I feel like this is a horribly efficient way to uh, punch buttons. Oh dear, look at that. We got electrocuted again. Okay, I, I'm, I'm still not convinced this is the right way to do it. Oh, that's like we just need to get good, I suppose. 
All right, so we keep going a little bit to the left. So let's. Ah. All right, let's try this one more time. <laughs> Dang. No itself. I can't punch buttons. My life depends on it. Holy, and I'm too stubborn to like pause the video now. Okay, well we almost had it there. Oh dear. All right, got him. Well, that kind of made things worse, didn't it? Yeah, it did. Okay, well, I guess I'm gonna end the episode here because I don't know how to punch the floor. Um, anyways, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.